20 Ways to Save Electricity at Home Recently, energy prices have risen dramatically, which makes energy savings more relevant than ever before. In this video, we will go over 20 ways to save electricity at home. So stay with us until the end to get all the tips so you can save money. But before you do, remember to subscribe so you don't miss out on future videos. 1. Adjust light use An easy tip is remembering to switch off unnecessary lights every time you leave a room. Also consider using fewer light bulbs. With higher wattages combined with reducing the number of bulbs in each room, for example, you can replace two to three 60-watt bulbs by installing 100-watt bulb in a room. Easy to overlook, one of the simplest things you can do to reduce energy use is to simply let the natural light in and avoid turning on electric lights during the day. You'll also find natural light better for your work in home environment. 2. Install energy efficient light bulbs. Talk about lighting. Another great tip is to swap incandescent lights for LED bulbs. LED light uses between 70 to 80 percent less energy than regular incandescent bulbs. You'll find these more expensive to purchase at first than regular bulbs, which use more energy, but they will last a lot longer than the regular ones. As a result, over time, the cost balances out and you can save more energy. LED lights are especially practical for exterior lighting, and some require turned on throughout the night. 3. Switch off energy draining appliances on standby. We have typically many different electronic appliances in our homes, which are on standby, and some of these use up 75% of their electricity consumption when switched off. If you take a simple tour of your home, you'll likely find at least several plugged-in items you're not using. Electrical items on standby are TVs, computers, and video game consoles. Many of these appliances draw a small amount of electricity whilst waiting for use. So switch them off when they're not in use to save electricity and conserve energy. To find these electrical appliances on standby, just look for a little light glowing. If you won't be using them for a while, turn them off at the wall to save energy. Even though the electricity they consume might seem small, it all adds up over a longer period of time and on your electric bill. Watch out for especially older appliances that are usually less energy efficient. 4. Install smart power strips An alternative to unplugging and switching off appliances at the wall is to use smart power strips. These are convenient and a fast way to save electricity and solve the problem with electronics not in use effectively. You can configure the power strip to shut off electricity to appliances when not in use. Some models even save electricity cost by setting timers to turn off the supply while you're at work or asleep. Here is a smart power plug that connects to an app where you can monitor the power consumption and set the timers for turning off the power. Combine with a power strip to get a very effective setup and forget power system that saves you money over time. 5. Fill up your washing machine and dishwasher. Your modern washing machine and dryer may be marked energy efficient, but they still consume a lot of electricity with each use. To utilize electricity as much as possible, pull your laundry together and do full loads. The result is you cut down on the number of times you're using the washer every week. Motivate yourself by thinking about how much money you're throwing away with each wash and minimize the number of washes. 6. Wash clothes in cold water. Wash your clothes in warm water only when it's really necessary. This is an easy way to save energy, as you don't need to wash clothes with warm water every time. Maximum temperatures are not required. Washing at 30 degrees Celsius is often as efficient as washing at 40 degrees Celsius. 7. Dry clothes and dishes outside. Another tip to save energy is not using the dryer and instead drying your clothes outside in the sun. If you need to use a dryer, consider using a lower setting, which takes longer but uses less energy. If you're using a dishwasher, ditch the heated drying cycle and wipe with dish towels instead. Another option is to leave the dishwasher door open and allow for some air drying. It's perfectly okay to let dishes air dry with same hygienic result. 8. Upgrade to appliances that are more efficient. When the time comes for replacing your appliances, you should definitely look for new models that provide the best energy efficiency. 
In the EU, look for AAA energy efficiency. And in the US, Energy Star rated fridges, washing machines, and other appliances. With each new energy efficient appliance you purchase, you'll find your total energy bill is getting lower. 9. Install programmable thermostat for comfort and cost savings. Many people consume electricity throughout the day because they don't want to go home to a too hot or too cold house. With a programmable thermostat, one of the most energy efficient appliances you can install, you can preset your home's temperature at different times of the day. For instance, you can keep your home at a specific temperature all day and set the smart thermostat to heat your home or reduce the temperature one hour before you get home. If you have a water heater that stores hot water, you can also use a timer to heat it before morning showers and evening dishwashing. This approach will help reduce the need for air conditioning or heating to run when you don't need it to, in turn using less energy. 10. Notch your refrigerator temperature down a little. Most of us do not pay much attention to the temperature our refrigerator operates at. We expect only to have cold drinks and vegetables remain fresh. However, be mindful of energy consumption and turn the temperature down a few degrees. A slight tweak to its thermostat, and your fridge will still keep everything cold and fresh. The small change results in less power used to help reduce your energy bills. 11. Eliminate air leaks to reduce drafts. Have you had that feeling hot air is finding its way into your comfortable air-conditioned living room in the summer? Or cold air flows from somewhere into the room in the winter? You likely have air leaks somewhere in your home. Look out for drafts from front doors and windows and repair them to prevent air leaking in from outside. You can also use weather strips to seal doors or windows where heat loss is an issue, resulting in less heating and cooling costs. We recommend you get a thermo picture taken of your house from outside to see where the heat leaks. 12. Using ceiling fans instead of air conditioners. Ceiling fans that circulate hot or cold air around the room use much less electricity compared to firing up the air conditioner. If you need to use air conditioning, consider using a lower setting. 13. Use doors and curtains. Only heat or cool the rooms you need. Simply installing and using thermal curtains can avoid heat loss to the outdoors in colder seasons. In addition, keep your living space cool by setting the air conditioner to a comfortable temperature, but not too cold either. Reducing the need for the air conditioning to run continuously to conserve energy. Shutting doors between rooms will also ensure that you don't end up paying for heating rooms that you don't use. 14. Insulate your water heater. Regardless of whether you heat your water with gas or electricity, wrap up your water heater cylinder in insulation if you have one. This one simple energy conservation step can save up to 10% of water heating costs on your electricity bill. 15. Unplug and defrost your freezer monthly. Your freezer benefits from occasionally defrosting. We recommend once a month. When excessive ice builds up in the freezer, the system needs to work harder to preserve the coolness and keep cool air flowing. As a result, a freezer in need of defrosting uses more energy and adds to your energy cost. Whenever you want to defrost, simply unplug the freezer and remove all the food items. Leave the door open for a faster melting process and then wipe and dry out the freezer. Turn it back on and once cool, repack your food items. Ensure that you place items correctly to allow easy flow of cooling air and improved energy saving because your freezer no longer needs to work too much. 16. Maintain appliances regularly. Your appliances will work more efficiently and save your electricity at home if they're cared for. For example, when your air conditioner air filters clog up, replacing it will save you electricity. By changing the filter monthly as we recommended, you can get enough cold air at a minimal temperature. 17. Maintain your energy saving insulation. Damaged insulation can increase energy consumption, both in the form of heating and cooling. According to energy.gov, 20% of the energy consumed in a home during winter results from heat loss through the attic. One of the more significant ways to save long-term is installing proper insulation in your home to protect it from unnecessary heat loss during the winter and help ensure your air conditioner doesn't have to work overtime to keep you cool during the summer. 
If you need to install or repair installation in your home but can't afford a contractor, many DIY videos are available online to guide you through the process. You'll find affordable insulation materials such as stone wool, natural fiber, sleek foils, and rigid foam boards easily accessible. Seek to buy locally produced materials to reduce the transport impacts as an energy conservation bonus. 18. Use carpets on tiles. Most of us have tiles that can be too cold to walk or place your feet on when sitting on a couch. In the winter, these tiles feel like ice on our feet, so we tend to turn up the heat. Here we recommend using carpets in these areas as the carpets will feel warmer in the winter. Carpets come in many sizes, so choose the one that fits the width of your couch or dining table. 19. Use a pressure cooker. A pressure cooker can speed up cooking time. Meat that needs a long time to get tender will benefit greatly from this. A dish, which takes one hour to simmer and become tender, can be cooked in a pressure cooker in just 10 minutes. Some people feel intimidated by this sealed pot, but once you learn how to use it, you'll have a hard time cooking without it. 20. Charge your car or wash clothes at night. If you want to save money, wash your clothes and charge your car at night. Electricity is frequently cheaper late at night or early in the morning because those are the off-peak hours where fewer people are utilizing electricity. Therefore, electricity is cheaper in this period. Modern washing machines and dishwashers have delay mode, where you can delay the washing for a certain amount of hours. Use this mode to start the washing and charge your car at night and save on electricity. I hope you enjoyed this video, and if you did, like and share this video. You can leave your questions and thoughts in the comment section below, and don't forget to subscribe.